For now, for now, for now, let's pray. Yeah, let's pray. Give me your hand. Jason, Jason's gonna pray. Another way that if you will understand and turn to you, you can also be willing to trust me to hear the Okay. Now, I'm going to talk to you about um, the parable of the lost sheep. This is from Luke 15, verse 4 to 7. If a man had 100 sheep and one of them gets lost, what would he do? Won't he leave the other 99 others in the wildness to go and search for that that one for that one that is lost until he finds it? And when he finds it, he will joyfully carry it home on his shoulders. When he arrives, he will call to the other his friends and neighbors, saying, "Rejoice with me, because I have found my sheep." In the same way, there is joy in heaven over one lost sinner who repents and returns to God than over, over 99 others who are righteous and haven't strayed away. So basically, it's telling us that we should turn to God and repent because that puts more joy in heaven than 99 other people who don't turn, who don't turn their back to Him. Amen. Jason. Come on. Come on. Good brother. Praise the Lord. So I'm dead now. Working. He 
when he returned means when he returned home he heard music and dancing going on in the air and yes one of the servants I was going on your brother is back he was told and your father's killed the fattened calf we're celebrating because because of his safe return the older brother was angry and didn't go in his father came out and begged him but he replied all this is I've slaved for you and 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 never once refused to do a single thing you told you told me to do and in and in that time you never you never gave me even one young goat for a feast with my friends yet this son of yours comes back after squandering your money on on prostitutes you celebrate him you celebrate by killing the fattened calf. His father, his father said to him, Look there, son, you have you have always stayed with me and everything I have is yours. We have celebrated this happy day. For your brother was dead and has come to life. He was lost but now found. Amen. So what we learned from that is that um, we should always be forgiving.